Hey everyone, it's Crypto Profit back with another video, and today we're going to be taking a quick look at Cardano. In the last seven days, we've actually seen Cardano increase about 5%, the last month about 38%, and the last year 125% of an increase. This is what we've loved to see about Cardano. It has so much fight in it because of all of the utility behind Cardano and its ecosystem. I do want to say the market cap over the entire crypto space has obviously continued to grow as well, so that may be a very large part as to why Cardano is rising in price. But I want to talk about what is so special about Cardano and what we could potentially see in the near future. Uh, so the first thing we're going to talk about is the in this week's edition, we cover how the 10 millionth block minted on Cardano. And as well, they also talk about the blockchain comparisons dashboard from the Edinburgh Decentralized Index. You also have the Japanese Cardano community at Web3 Week Tokyo. So a lot of good things happening with the Cardano community in this week's edition of the Cardano Community Digest. This was back March 4th, 2024. But like I said, a lot of cool stuff coming. And uh, I will continue to update you guys here on the channel about Cardano. So if you haven't already, make sure to like the video, subscribe to the channel, and turn notifications on. But we do have a lot to talk about when it comes to Cardano. The first real article we're going to jump into here is on the CryptoBasic.com. It talks about how Cardano secures the $1.50 price target as analysts highlight breakout potential. And this is something we've talked about in previous videos as well. Here we have the Crypto Recruiter. If you guys have been following Cardano, you probably have heard of this guy talking about Cardano since the very beginning. And a lot of us do see a $1.50 ADA target. And I'm going to continue to see more and more people talking about this with Trend Writer as well, just like it did in the past bull market and when it went from $0.20 cents to $3.00. The so basically the in this tweet or this post he's talking about how there is a confirmed cross of our parabolic red line like before and that same was predicted with Bitcoin's new all time high months ago. I do think all altcoins are going to have a nice little season as well. So Cardano obviously being an altcoin at this time is going to take a part in that. And before we jump into the next thing, I do want to say as well, I am not a financial advisor, so always do your own financial uh, you know due diligence. And one of the big things I want to take a look at today is Go Mining. It's an easy way to earn every day. You buy digital miners backed by the real power of their data centers and receive rewards every day, upgrading your mining farm, and you can complete simple daily tasks and get involved in the game to increase your profits. So I want to talk a little bit about this project before we go back to Cardano, because if you haven't heard of it, it's something you may be missing out on and want to get involved with. So they have nine data centers across the globe belong to Go Mining, and they also have Bitcoin mining equipment at these places that work around the clock at each of their sites. So by purchasing an NFT from Go Mining, you obtain a portion of the power of these real machines. So it's a very, very cool concept here. You'll see the number of NFTs sold, 68,577. The amount of THs sold, the total mined by users, total number of NFT holders, and the total number of Go Mining token holders. So it's all there and available to us. We just have to actually do our own due diligence, find out what NFT you want to purchase, and get involved with this project. So the first thing I'm going to jump into is my personal account here. Um, and again, I have a different account with more, but this is one that has one miner so you guys can understand how it works. So I actually have a, uh, a miner myself. It's 9544. It's the West Collection. If we click it, it'll tell us how much we're actually going to make on this specific machine or this NFT. So you can see the computing power here at 1, uh, 1 TH, I should say, and the energy efficiency at W or sorry, 35 WTH. So this is a very, very solid secondary market purchase when it comes to NFTs. You can actually see here on the left side all of the different options and categories you can jump into. In my NFT, if I go to miners, this is my miner, of course. If I go to my dashboard, I'll be able to see all of the information regarding my rewards in Bitcoin, how many miners I have, the power, and the mean efficiency. Very, very cool stuff here. You can actually see your rewards as well, of course. If you go to rewards, I've been earning now for a couple of weeks on this account. Uh, if it loads here, you can also, there we go. If it loads, it goes down to 229. So February 29th, I actually did get this NFT and it started earning for me ever since. Again, it's very easy to sell as well. So you can actually go to the sell side and you'll see your listings. And then of course, you can go to the marketplace as well. You can see the primary and this is where you can actually buy these NFTs 
for a little bit more pricey than the secondaries, but they earn you a lot, lot more. So huge ROIs. You can see the anticipated ROI on this one right here, 137%. That is a very solid anticipated ROI. The net reward being $3,594 and the payback period here being nine months. You also see the historical ROI at 65.9%, the net reward at 1,722, and then the payback period of one year, six months. So you can actually see last year's rewards as well, and it's all available to you. And so you can understand quickly how this all works. If we actually go though on the, like I said, left side here, you can see the tokenomics you can see the collection itself. You can see the KYC. You can actually see the NFT game itself, whether the leaderboards or game you're looking for. It's all available to us, and it's a very, very cool website that gives you all the information you need. So again, if you are interested, I'll have links down in the description of today's video so you guys can get yourself your own miner. Let's jump back, though, into now Cardano because Cardano is something that I do want to talk about more about with this altcoin season coming. Cardano comeback story is emerging. So Cardano's path to growth being DEX volumes and market dynamics contributing to the expected rise in Cardano's price is its network activity, which has seen a notable uptick in the DEX or decentralized exchange volumes, indicative of growing interest and liquidity within its ecosystem. This surge has propelled the trading volume past 130 million ADA mark alongside a significant increase in the network's total value locked. The amount of ADA on DEXs Cardano's network has seen an increase in network fees 20.7% over the past month alone. We also have this article here on Coinpedia talking about how Cardano whales have been accumulating heavily. ADA price appears to be programmed to hit $1 soon. So one of the story highlights that they have here at the top on Coinpedia is the Cardano failed to secure the levels at 0.8 or 80 cents as the bears restricted the rally at around 78 cents for the second consecutive time in a month. Besides, the Cardano whales and the retail traders have shifted their focus over the token, which could keep the bullish trend for a long time. So I do agree that we have seen a lot of bullish momentum, obviously, in Cardano. You'd be stupid if you thought otherwise. However, I will say that this doesn't mean we're going to see a $3 Cardano in the next month or even the next two or three months. It's going to take a lot longer, I believe, for altcoin season to hit. With Bitcoin doing big things, though, I do think we are trending in the right direction. Will ADA hit that $1 in March 2024? So ever since the start of the month, the ADA price has been closely consolidating within the range of $0.75. Cents. This may suggest the bulls could be accumulating strength to trigger, which may result in a bullish breakout beyond the interim threshold of $0.80. Cents. However, from a longer perspective, the token remains under acute bullish influence following a bullish pattern and achieving the milestone at $1 anytime in the month. So a lot of people are suggesting that it does have what it takes to reach $1 by the end of March. I do see that as a possible potential possibility, I should say, but $3, like I said, that all-time high push is not quite there yet. So I'm excited to see where Cardano goes in the next month or two, and we will keep you guys up to date here on the channel. So like I said previously, if you have not already, make sure to like the video, subscribe to the channel, and turn notifications on. I'll see you guys all in the next one.